Well, how are you doing? Right, you don't have to tell me. I can tell just by looking at your face. You've got that look of panic, just like Lindo did when he first became a leader. First thing you need to do is take a deep breath. No one's expecting you to do everything on your own. Use your comrades, use yourself. That's the key to breeding trust. I'm sure you'll make a fine leader. All right, get back to work. I'll be counting on you. I don't know. When you say the rations are getting lamer and lamer by the day, I know we can't afford to be picky, but really, that ration pudding, for instance, tasted unhealthy, for God's sake. It's so lumpy and sweet, it almost made me puke. Hey, Selma, I've been thinking we should throw a party for our new leader here on our next day off. Are you in? No, thanks. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. Go ahead and have your little love fest. Just leave me out of it. Jeez! Don't act so high and mighty just because you're a better fighter. And don't be so arrogant after showing up late. That's why you don't have any friends, loser! Jeez! I, I'm just trying to... Well, that guy's too antisocial. Whoops! It's time to launch the operation. Okay, let's head out. Who's there? Show yourself. I know you're there. Hey, hold up! It's only me! Huh. Huh, so it's you. Hey, thanks a lot! I came out here looking for you since you never came back to base! Who asked you to look for me? I'm gonna do whatever the hell I want. But we're comrades from the same unit. Don't be so egocentric. <laughs> comrades, huh? If you're talking about the kind of comrades who can't survive a little jab, who you can't even trust to have your back, it's better not to have them at all. Why, you... Okay, then. You're so special. You're incredible. You think you're such a hot shot? Suit yourself! I'm heading back! Without you! You shouldn't have anything to do with a monster like me. Your achievements of late have been quite spectacular. I never imagined that you'd develop such leadership qualities in so short a time. It must be a new type characteristic. Now then, you may already be aware of this, but the Aegis Project is about to enter its final stage. The Ark that will protect us from the Aragami threat and guide humankind to a new future it will soon be completed. Certainly a cause for celebration. We are almost there. I'd like you to help me just a bit longer. I'm expecting someone now. Forgive me, let's continue this another day. At any rate, I expect even loftier achievements from you and your unit. That's all. You're dismissed. Are you the type of person who has a great deal of curiosity? It's you, Paler.
Johan. Are you planning to turn that kid into another lapdog? I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, about that task I gave you. I have yet to receive a status update from you. Oh, you mean the singularity? Sorry, but I still have nothing to go on. I see. It's integral to the project. So carry on. Well, I know you've got someone else looking for it, too. How's that coming along? Well, with only Soma on the job, success is so far elusive. Ah, so that's why you were trying to lure that kid into becoming one of your minions. I wish you'd learn to speak with more delicacy, Doctor. Just concentrate on observing, as always. Right. I look upon the entire universe as the subject of my observation. Which is precisely the reason why I don't ever want to let anything that catches my eye go to waste. Thank you kindly for your words of warning, Stargazer. Please continue to watch over our movements. Now then, which side will you join? Young rookie leader, Just as we thought, embedding the bias factor into the adult organism would be difficult. Even then, it looks like it would be hard to induce apoptosis. Our best bet is to probably do it in the prenatal stage. We've had success with rats, at least. Either way, it's high time we conducted a clinical test on a human. I'm not rejecting that kind of approach, taking something we don't understand in principle and using it blindly. But we're just starting to understand what makes the P73 bias factor tick. I'm not sure we're ready to do this yet. How can we just sit back and wait? When nearly 10,000 people a day are being devoured by the Aragami. Are you saying you're going to test it on yourself? Like Pettenkofer? Yes. If it proves feasible, then I'll test it on myself. Johannes, let's embed it into my... into our baby. Have you lost your mind? I know this is your project, but... not our child. It's a bridge that somebody has to cross. So why not us? But... It's feasible, but I can't agree to it. I have no intention of letting our future children see a world on the brink of destruction. You have my support. Both parents approve, huh? Then there's no room for discussion, is there? In that case, I'm taking myself off this project. Our methodology is too much at odds. Sakaki. I'll always be a stargazer. I'm someone who observes the stars. I'm not going to interfere with your crucial decisions. I'm going to continue my bias factor research in my own way. I'm sure our paths will cross again. Excuse me. Goodbye. How are you feeling? Fine, and physically well, too. I can't wait for your birth. Where's Sakaki? He sent you a good luck charm for a safe delivery. But he's still unreachable. I see. So he's still angry with us... ...for pushing ahead with the project. Don't think about that now. It's not good for you. I want you to hold on to that charm for me. Good luck tomorrow.
Hello, Paler. It's been a long time. As you know, following that appalling incident, the Managom project was, for all intents and purposes, suspended. The only survivors of that accident were Soma, who was born carrying the bias factor, and myself, who happened to have your safe birth charm in my possession. Who knew that the charm technology you developed would one day be used to build an anti-Aragami armored wall, protecting humankind from the Aragami? As a scientist, I'm painfully aware that I cannot hold a candle to you. Most likely, you had predicted that this would come to pass. Am I wrong? Hm. Fear not. I'm not sending this email in order to blame you for anything. In the coming weeks, I'll be appointed director of the Fenrir Far East Branch. And so, I'd like to ask you to join forces with me once again. In return, I promise you ample funding for your research. And you will also be in charge of all development pertaining to the God Eaters. By the way, I never introduced you to my son. Well, that being so, expect me to call on you in the near future. Until then, my friend. Let's cut to the chase, shall we? What's this about? Merely a final confirmation. So, you have no intention of reconsidering. The project is heading into the final stages. We can't abort now. I see. In that case, I have some good news for you. A civilian informant reported this. It seems a core with oracle cells of unprecedented power has been detected in the former British region. The Singularity? I haven't been able to confirm that yet. But that region is under the direct supervision of headquarters. Even my access is quite limited. I understand. I'll be heading to Europe for a while. Will you look after things while I'm gone? Fine. I'll be more than happy to for a while. Although, I'll just be continuing my research as usual. Right. The fewer obstacles to your research, the better. <laughs> 